gains. You want to look around? That's where they kept the ammo for the Civil War. Is that right? And the Spanish... Spanish-American War. And the Spanish-American War. I just wanted to show you where I'm at today. Ooh, that's old rib ship. section found in the Gulf from the old shipwreck. That's where they said, damn the torpedoes, full speed ahead. That's <laughs> it. Love you. I'll show you around later. Bye. footsteps as they enter down the long hallway. <laughs> Get that horse out of here, soldier. <laughs> I told you get him out of here. Oh wow. Bastion held the powder shell and shot during the American Civil War smaller. Lady rooms located inside these rooms that were used to store the shots from the shell and the shells from any dampness or moisture which could seep through the brick. Well, damn it, it ain't working. It's done got wet in here. You've heard of a ball and chain? Well, what do you think of me now? Is that? I need that on my boat. <laughs> I don't think that'll fit on your boat. It might sink your boat. <laughs> you can make that uh, selfie stick a cane. <laughs> We're here at the fort. As you can see, a lot of the buildings have survived. There's Peggy. And it's amazing some of the stuff that did survive here. They've got the um, some cannons around and got a museum up there, a big anchor. But most amazingly, the thing that shocked me the most is the restrooms. They're in incredibly good shape for being, what, 160 years old, 150? Uh, this is the men's room. You can see the concrete is still smooth. And it has some of the original fixtures in here. I didn't know it back then, but they even had stalls in the restrooms. They had urinals. There's even a fan left over from the Civil War here. I did not realize the Army back then was so progressive. But believe it or not, look at this. They actually had a ladies' room. They had a women's restroom. And I won't go in there. I won't go in there, but as you can see, they did have a ladies' room back in the mid-1800s. It's amazing. <laughs>